Hello everyone. Um, just in the garage here, looking through the things that I need to start pulling apart, cleaning up. Um, plenty of things to do. The side of the house looks pretty good. Now it's time for this garage to get cleaned up. Now, unfortunately, we were back last week and we thought, oh yes, we're going to do some street scrapping. But unfortunately, my wife got COVID and uh, it's gone through the family. My kids have had it now and the last one to get it now is me. So, under the rules here in Victoria, we have to isolate for seven days. So, in these seven days... I think I might isolate in my garage and just uh, do a bit of cleaning up and uh, get a few of these things um, scrapped. Now, we did last week pick up quite a few nice things, uh, so I'll just add the, the video of those finds here before I start uh, cleaning this place up just a quick video guys uh, this was just a short uh, trip to the shops and uh, you wouldn't believe it but there's quite a few things um, out on the streets so I'll just quickly show you so this is a pump still has the brass piping on it um, found these really good uh, Mubu timbers so they always come in handy when you're working around the house manual log screen not sure exactly what this is I've never seen one of these before so um, there's about five or six fans we have Scooters, the kids' scooters. We have like a small little trolley here. We've got three batteries that we found, car batteries. There's a little one there, and there's another one just underneath. Cords. Um, this platform, this aluminium platform. This is a really cool. Uh, it's really cool too, as you can see on the car um, platform. The green slide. So this is actually for our farm. Um, I've built a treehouse for the kids with just a thrown out pallets, timber pallets, and uh, this slide is uh, going to be awesome. So maybe I'll show you one day what I've built um, what else is there I believe there's another motor down there and have a look at this thing so this is like a gas uh, so it's a gas four burner with the frame so somebody's built a frame around it um, so I'm not sure what we can really use it for if we can use it for somehow for melting possibly I'm not sure but uh, I grabbed that anyway so here's yeah, some really cool things so just, just to show you there's also an antique uh, couple of antique things here I've got to get it all out and then maybe I'll do a video So just got it all out and uh, to show you, so that's a couple of motors with a pump, a garage motor, number of aluminium scooters, the antique thing that I was talking about is uh, this thing. 
don't know, it might not be very antique, but it looks antique. These timbers are super cool, I need them. As I'm doing the project. There's cords, as always. A couple of the DVD players and uh, the menu log screen. Five fans. Some aluminium and stainless steel. Uh, domestic there, aluminium. A couple of taps, it's a bit of brass there. The three batteries. This trolley is also super cool. It's a bit worn out, but it's really good. So I might use that with a trailer when we go for the bigger um, street scraps. Now this is that burner, and you can see how it's uh, sitting on this frame. So not sure what we can use it for, but uh, we'll see. Still haven't taken that off because I'm taking that to the farm. And there's also a shelving, uh, like brand new. I, I have no idea why people actually throw this stuff out, but it's actually brand new, never been used. As you can see, it comes with the five shelves, and uh, someone's just thrown it out. But that's okay. We'll pick it up and uh, I'll try and make this another pile this looks like a brand new Logitech oh, this is alright let's grab this somebody's cut the cords already some cool guns Maybe I'll grab them for the kids This is really good Is that maybe a TV? PSP? Oh, what? No. No way. <laughs> wow. The games are still in there. Wow. This is awesome. Another keyboard. Another game. Okay. I'll have to get through this. Seven habits of highly effective people. There you go. The irony. Found a good book for myself. Wow, well, I'll have to go through that box a bit more. There's some good stuff there. Somebody's cut the cord of the fridge. What it looks like. Yeah. The cord's been cut. How did I miss this? This is unreal. So all together there were six games of that. Um, just wondering, this looks like a TV. I don't want to lift that up if it's only a TV. Where did it Where did it show? Oh, what? No. Nike E. These are pretty much brand new. Oh, my God. This pile just keeps on giving. Not sure what that is, looks like. Like guys. Do I 
Das ist Durchfahrt, ey. There's a lot of cards and whatnot, but uh, I'm not interested in it. I will take these Nike shoes, that is awesome. Nice pile. I don't have my trailer with me, but uh, I would have picked up their fridge and this microwave. I will take the microwave now. Another couple of things picked up. Another big uh, battery. This is an actual heater. I'll show you guys later. Some plants. As you can see, it's not all bare metal, but uh, I do collect some plants also for a garden. Some DVD players, cords. But uh, just come up to a big pile. This barbecue is really good. It's a big barbecue. Yeah, but it's too big. I don't have a trailer. An Edge, an Edgia, an Amoa, microwave. Collect them all, but no trailer, so. Looks like I have to pick which one I take. That's a Honda too. They actually sell. Uh, they got a good resale, resale value. I'm gonna take this edge up. That looks good. Let's see what else I can fit. As you saw in that pickup, this is the PSP that we found. Believe it or not, it actually does work. And uh, kids are absolutely loving it so I cannot believe some of the things that we do pick up in a hard rubbish as you can see some really cool things and uh, yeah we enjoy doing it so thank you for watching this video I know it's a short one um, we'll try and uh, Clean up some of the garage and uh, we'll bring you the next video. Um, bye. bye for now.